I can't see Stephen Wolf's tweets anymore. He has protected his account, and I'm not one of the people now privileged to look upon his tweets. That's a bad look. The day after posting something like this, and then you go into hiding, bad look. Really bad look. Doesn't help at all. Um, but you know he posted the Norman Rockwell picture of a room full of white people. And one of them, simple looking man, just a regular working man, is speaking. I don't know what the background of it is. Looks like it's in a school someplace because there's a blackboard in the back. Throw out a short statement that has one obvious meaning but could have all sorts of sub meanings. And then when everybody goes nuts, come back and say, oh, but I just obviously meant this. And if, if you read it that way, then it must mean there's something wrong with you. How many times has that happened? You just automatically go, oh, I, I do. I, I wasn't referring to that. Okay. So Stephen Wolf posted this and said, white evangelicals are the lone bulwark against moral insanity in America. Now, Stephen Wolf claims to be a Christian. And then as far as the lone bulwark thing, you know, the voting blocks are not a bulwark. I think this is just a matter of just refusing to allow uh, the context to dictate what you're talking about. It's, it would be like I said this on Twitter today. I said it would be like, you know, you've got a, 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 a group of shock troopers or, 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 or um, you know, just troopers that are like well, well into enemy territory. Right. And they get surrounded by the enemy. And they're there, and they're they're like commandos, and they were dropped in there, and now now they're like surrounded, and like they they they're they're going to die, like they're going to they they've got no hope of escape, right? And they say, oh, and one of them says, hey hey hey, I I, I remember seeing a radio over there from one of our fallen comrades. Our only hope of salvation is to get to that radio to let our 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 guys know where we're at, and then they can come save us. And then somebody goes to him and, and they get all furious and an argument starts because they say, what do you mean that's our hope for salvation? That's not our only hope for salvation. Salvation is only found in the Lord. And you look at him like, are you, are you freaking insane, dude? Like, 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 I'm not talking about that. Of course, Jesus is our salvation. We get it. I'm, I've got a situation here. <laughs> like, like, my goodness, like, why are you lawyering me to death? <laughs> I just don't get it. I just don't get it. Oh, but what 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 was the what was the defense yesterday? It was just simply a description of demographics. He was just simply talking about voting patterns. Well, he didn't put that in his tweet, did he? And that's purposeful. You know that's purposeful. 